All right, as I said before, I'm Frankie Puckett. I work at Paintsville Elementary. I'm the K-5 resource teacher right now. And at this particular moment, when I started my grant, I had ordered Chromebooks to do a one-to-one, -one, but my caseload has increased to like, I'm up to 22. So I'm not quite there yet, I'm working on it though. So I wanted my students, because like I said, mine range from different abilities. I have some FMD students down to specific learning disability and all in between. And I have a Head Start and like I said, up to fifth grade. So my students have difficulties reading just grade level material, so I wanted to be able to give them an opportunity to show what they know. You know, have them have a reader, not just a human reader, but one that could they could repeat and repeat as needed. And also to help with independent spelling skills, which will lead into the writing. Okay, uh, this is what I ended up getting with my grant. I was lucky enough and I found, but I searched, <laughs> and I ended up getting six Chromebooks, uh, two of the external DVD drives because we have so many CDs and DVDs that we're not using anymore because Chromebooks do not come with that capability. So I ordered a few and I already had a few that Mr. Auksher had got me before and then a DVD player for my educational games. And I also ended up getting a TV, which we're not hooked up yet, but we're working on it. And then I ordered a spinning wheels that I can use in the class for reading, writing, spelling. We just put on this one, we'll add um, different like questions on the story that we read or different math problems. And I can, all right, uh, here are a few of the apps and programs that we have used along that I can use with my DVD player. I was fortunate enough that our special ed department bought us the RAS, the Reading A to Z, which uh, that was one of my things I wanted for, for it. But we also ended up getting the phonics program with it as well. So I and our other special ed teacher share that. Okay. There we go. All right, so if you look, this is, and I didn't get permission from parents, so I put their faces out. So these are my students using the equipment that I've got. And like I said, we wanted to use things that was more accessible to the students on all grade levels. So we ended up getting the Reading A to Z, Get Epic is a book program where they can go in and listen and it highlights it for them. They can go back and reuse and redo as needed. And all of my students really enjoyed the Chromebooks. Like I said, I was hoping to get a one-to-one -one Chromebook uh, ratio, but I've not got there yet. So hopefully next year we'll get there if Mr. Auksher will give me some more. All right, um, and that's it. You know, I've seen progress in my students as far as being able to read. Like my one was basically nonverbal. He's now doing some speaking and he's reading some words he's working on rhyming on sets on sets and rhymes so we have seen progress and we just want to see more with this diverse group that i have and that's it any questions go ahead all my stuff came from amazon or walmart Yes, it is. Okay, I will give you a word of advice. If you order one, only use black because all the other colors will stain it because we were going to do like various colors on it, but it doesn't work. Uh, the Black Expo regular markers is what works the best. A couple of the Chromebooks were touch screen. Yes, actually, uh, it took me a lot longer to figure out which Chromebooks I wanted and to get the better price. So I ended up getting four touch screen Chromebooks and two regular ones because I have a couple of students that cannot manipulate a mouse and map testing was really hard so they're able to use that as well. Any other questions?